express f of x in the form f of x equals x minus k times the quotient plus the remainder for the given value of k. We have f of x, which is equal to 8x to the fourth minus 2x cubed minus 15x squared minus x when k is equal to 3. Okay, so let's take a look at this problem here. So first thing we want to do is we want to find what is the quotient, which is q of x. So we know the value of k is 3. And then we're going to write our coefficients. So we have 8, and that's the coefficient for x to the fourth. And then we have negative 2. And then we have negative 15. And then we have negative 1. And then we should also have a 0 for a placeholder for the constant. So it's very important to make sure you include that. Okay, now we're going to bring down the 8. So 3 times 8 is going to give us positive 24. And 24 minus 2 is going to give us 22. And then 3 times 22 is going to give us 66. 66 or negative 15 plus 66 is going to give us 51. 51 times 3 is going to give us 153. Negative 1 plus 153 is 152. And 3 times 152 is going to give us 456. So therefore we have 456. So now one less degree from x to the fourth is going to be x to the third. So this is going to be 8x to the third plus 22x squared plus 51x plus 152 with the remainder of 456. So we know that the quotient is going to equal 8x cubed plus 22x squared plus 51x plus 152. The remainder is equal to 456. Okay, and then the value of k is equal to 3. And so therefore this becomes x minus 3. So now if we wanted to write it in this form, which is here, right, we know that this is going to be x minus k, which is 3. And then multiply by q of x, which is the quotient, which is 8x cubed plus 22x squared plus 51x plus 152 plus the remainder which is 456. So let's go ahead and put that in there. So we have x minus 3 and then we have 8x cubed plus 22x squared plus 51x so plus 22x squared plus 51x plus 152 with the remainder of 456. So plus 152 with the remainder of 456. Check our answer and there is our result.